Good afternoon. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you to the University of Georgia, and uh, thank you to the Peabody Committee for selecting us this year. Um, this is our second Peabody, um, and growing up, uh, I always dreamed of winning three of these. <laughs> so you're close. You're close. We're going to get there. Um, I also, before I forget anything else, I want to thank the network um, for all the freedom they gave us to do this thing that was possibly illegal. And, and especially the Viacom for strongly resisting us doing this thing that was possibly illegal. Um, because um, we, we won, this is our accidental Peabody. We won it by accident because we never intended to do this. I was just trying to mock a Tim Pawlenty ad and we didn't know how to finish the ad, our ad. And I said, what's at the end of his ad? And his ad said libertypack.com. I said, so just put Colbert Pack on the end of our ad. And M M Meredith Bennett, my co-executive producer, said, do you want to buy that URL? I said, yeah. And then someone from the network, I assume a lawyer, called and said, are you, are you really going to form a pack? <laughs> and I said, why do you need to know? And they said, because if you do, that could be trouble. And I said, well, then we're definitely going to form a pack. <laughs> And it has been the most wonderful trouble, and I want to thank them for, for being, getting into the trouble with this. And I want to publicly apologize for my tone of voice at times, um, uh, because they were honestly concerned, and as well they should. I don't think we should have been able to do our show this year, legally. The things we got away with were a little alarming. Um, this is the greatest award, I think, because everybody on the staff gets it. And there's never been a, a time in our show when the staff has all deserved it more. Um, and of course, some people on the staff worked especially hard um, on this sort of year-long game we've played. And those people would be everyone on the staff. So congratulations to you guys. But I especially have to thank um, our team of lawyers from Kaplan and Drysdale. Uh, Matt Sanderson and, of course, the inimitable Trevor Potter, who, yeah. Evidently, Trevor has broken new ground in, in celebrity. He is the first ever superstar campaign finance lawyer. <laughs> and we have to thank John Stewart and The Daily Show for playing with us when we came closest to breaking the law, but sadly, never did. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you to the Peabody's, and, and thank you to everybody. Thanks.